Well, it's one of the absolutely most exciting fields in biology now. We are learning new things about human body, which we never knew anything about. There is a whole organ in our body, two kilograms of mass, ten times more cells than, our, than the cells of our body. We know so little about the organ or its interaction <coughs> with the rest of our uh, organism. It is absolutely most exciting thing to try to find the relations, the interactions, the crosstalk, the links with health, disease and well-being. My research focus after what I have just said, how could it be anything else than correlation between the composition of microbial populations that constitute that neglected organ and other parts of our body. More specifically, we do work on trying to describe in detail how the millions of genes that we have found, discovered, how they assembled in species. And we have found how to do that. Now we want to see how the properties of these species, which are conferred on them by these <coughs> genes, how these properties affect our lives and our health. Well, they are actually of two types. One is let us understand better human body, human biology, so many interactions, even with our brain effects on our behavior. Simply understand better human being in its fullness. The second, it's absolutely considerable the effect that our knowledge of this new organ on the health could be. Present day health is based on treatment of sickness. Studies that we are doing allow us to believe that maybe that focus will shift towards much more prevention. If we are able to detect by analyzing the state of this new organ, early signs, early signs of uh, coming chronic disease and intervene before the disease has really uh, induced irreversible modifications, then we could save lots of suffering for individuals and also tremendous amount of resources that presently go into treating. So actually, when I think about that, I have impression that the work we are carrying out today will have at least as much effect on human society as the work that was carried out 50 years ago on the informatics, on communication, on all this new technology which has really changed the way people live.